overtime. Down seven, national championship on the line. Facing a fourth and three. That's when it happened. A play known now simply as the call. Campbell is there, had that ball in and out of his hands. Pass is incomplete. The Miami Hurricanes are national champions. They threw a flag down in the corner of the end zone, Kevin. A late flag came out. Well, it had to have been a very late flag. It was a late flag, and it came out down in the corner of the end zone. Terry Porter's delayed pass interference call not only ceased Miami's title celebration, it breathed new life into Ohio State. We all know what happened next. Krenzel's touchdown sending the game into a second overtime. Claret's touchdown to put the Bucks on top. And that defensive stand that gave OSU their first national title in 34 years. This is destiny. You know, we're meant to be here. We're meant to, to win this game. The Miami viewpoint is a bit different. It was a bad call, but, um, you know, you got to live with it. Tampa Bay tight end and former Kane Kellen Winslow has lived with it for nearly eight years. But as upsetting as that night in Tempe may have been, the past is the past for Winslow. Any talk of revenge this weekend just doesn't register with him. You know, I'm, I'm a king for life, but it kind of just, I, I didn't even know they were playing, to tell you the truth. Uh, I really didn't. I'm, I'm worried about this game, you know, my game. But for those in scarlet and gray, it's a lot easier to reminisce the feelings when that late flag was thrown. Instant relief went through, I think, myself and all of my teammates around me, like, we have another chance. We have a fighting chance to come back and win this game. And I will say that it was a good call. Well, some Hurricanes may not agree with Fox, but the National Association of Sports Officials does. They upheld Terry Porter's call, and Referee Enterprises Magazine actually ranked it as one of the top 18 calls ever. But as you heard, nearly eight years later, a lot of Hurricanes still carry that grudge. Saturday, they'll get a little shot at redemption when the Canes and Bucks tee it up in the long-awaited, much-anticipated rematch from the shoe. For Buckeye Blitz, I'm Greg Miller.